Hi, it's Jen. Welcome to my room tour of a studio room at Disney Hilton Head Island Resort, which is a Disney Vacation Club property. I recently spent four days at this resort. I had an amazing time. I have lots of great videos coming out with trip vlogs and tips and tricks and more information about what it's like to stay here. So if you're interested in that or really any kind of Disney vlogs, make sure you subscribe to my channel. As you first walk in the room, over on your right, you've got a great kitchenette with a microwave, a Mr. Coffee coffee maker, and a toaster. You've also got a pretty decent sized mini fridge with a small freezer compartment. This is me turning that up. You always wanna check that when you first get to the room. You've also got a sink, paper towels, a dish towel, and then in this drawer they had wrapped utensils as well as a wine opener and a can opener. And down here you've got wrapped cups, bowls, plates, some really nice artwork on the wall. And then you come to the closet. There was plenty of hanging room with a lot of hangers. You could always ask for more if you needed them, as well as a vacuum cleaner, a dry mop, and then the bedding for the pull-out sofa bed. The bathroom was a really good size. This is um, an ADA bathroom, so there is a roll-in shower. So if you needed a bathtub, you definitely would want to request that. Plenty of towels, some fishing lures on the wall, again with a fishing theme. You've got toilet tissue, facial tissue, and your blow dryer. The sink had lotion and face soap, and then you've got your shampoo, conditioner, and body wash all wrapped in plastic, so you're sure that that is sanitized, and I really appreciated that. The shower itself had good water pressure and nice hot water. As you come into the room itself, you've got a nice, super comfy queen-size bed with plenty of pillows. You've also got a full-size pull-out sleeper sofa. I did not open that up, but I believe it's one of the new ones, so you don't have a bar in the middle of your back, which is nice. This door would lead to the rest of the villa if this were a two-bedroom villa, and then you've got a nice Honeywell thermostat on the wall. I had no issues with the air conditioning in this room. Over on the other side of the room, you've got a small table and two chairs, as well as a TV and a really nice sized dresser. The TV, later I would find out, actually played the same resort TV, which I just was over the moon about. To hear that music again, so fun. And then you've got the activity and dining guide. They did have quite a few activities going on, uh, more so than I would have thought. Although do be advised, all the dining is shut down as of four o'clock at this resort. So you'd have to either walk over to Shelter Cove, drive to a restaurant or have groceries in your villa. The parking pass works there at the resort and also will get you on the Palmetto Dunes so that you can go to the beach house. And you can actually park at the beach house 24 seven, even when the beach house itself isn't open so that you can go and walk on that beautiful beach. And then this is why you go to Hilton Head. Look at this gorgeous balcony. It was so peaceful out here. And yes, those are rocking chairs. I cannot tell you how much I enjoyed having coffee out here each morning and then my wine in the evenings. It was truly a lovely place to retreat. I had a really pretty view of the grounds, that gorgeous Spanish moss hanging from the trees. And then over to the right, I could just see the marsh. Hilton Head Island uh, is beautiful in and of itself. The resort is really well done, very natural in the landscaping. They do have a feature pool here at this resort. They have a small 
gift shop that had a few items. I still managed to find enough to purchase, but not a big selection of Disney merchandise, but you know, enough to, to give me a little bit of a fix. Mickey food. The Mickey waffles were amazing. They've also got Mickey ice cream bars, Mickey ice cream sandwiches, and yes, that is a spiked Dole Whip, which I thoroughly enjoyed. Please subscribe to my channel if you want to see more great videos that are coming up. Thanks for being here, and I hope you're being really good to each other.